Top story, the father of a young man who was killed in Yuma after being struck by a hit and run driver is speaking out. News 11's Arlette Youssef brings us more from the victim's emotional family. A harmless ride turned into a parent's worst nightmare as three friends went out together but didn't come home together. A father pleading for justice for his son, 18-year-old Alan Cunningham. The young man's life was cut short after being hit by a vehicle that fled the scene. Cunningham's father says this is something he never expected. You're going to miss him a lot. And uh, I just wish I could have been there, you know, to save him. Just the best. He was my best friend. The eldest of six siblings, one he never got to meet. Alan used to spend the summers with us, and um, we were really looking forward to spending that time with him again. And because of the pandemic, we had to be able to travel. He didn't even get a chance to meet his baby sister. Now all that's left are memories of a happy kid. If the person who did this could even realize how many lives they affected, everyone loved Alan. He had, he was the first grandson on his dad's side. Alan, when he would walk into a room, he would just like have this amazing smile. Just Cunningham was about to celebrate high school graduation. Instead, the family is faced with planning a funeral. Now a father says goodbye to his firstborn child. Please, please. If anybody that knows anything, just come forward, please. Cunningham was riding his bike eastbound on 32nd Street early Wednesday morning when Yuma police say he, along with another friend, were hit by a driver who took off. The vehicle that left the scene is believed to be a silver 2011 to 2013 Chrysler 200 and likely to have front end damage, especially on the driver's side with a broken headlight. YPD says anyone with information can remain anonymous and may receive a $1,000 reward for information leading to an arrest. The family has created a GoFundMe account to help with funeral expenses. The link can be found at KYMA.com. Reporting in Yuma, Arlette Youssef, News 11.